students learn um, a, multiple ways to solve three digit by one digit multiplication in grade four and two digit by two digit multiplication in grade five. Um, one of those ways is called front end multiplication whereby we are not using a diagram anymore and we're just manipulating the numbers to solve. So we would take 453 and multiply it by six and we would change that to a vertical position. And then we would take our number six and multiply it by 453 and do just what um, it describes, front end multiplication and we'd start from the front. However, it's important for students to remember that that when they multiply six times four, that that four is not four, it is 400. And that five is not five, it is actually 50. And of course, the three in the ones place is three. So when they do the multiplication, they do six times 400, six times 50, and then six times three. And underneath, they line up their place value. This is all mental math. So six times 400, six times four is 24, and then they would annex their two zeros. Six times five is 30, and they would annex a zero to know that that's 300. And six times three is 18. We would take those products and add them together to get our final product, that 400, 53 times 6 equals 2,718. With front end multiplication, we add an extra step when we do two digit times two digit. We take our numbers and we line them up vertically. We have, sorry about that, 45 times 27. And it looks the exact same way. We start from the front. We take our number 27 and we multiply the 20 by 4. We multiply the 20 by 5. Then we take our 7. We multiply our 7 by 40 and we multiply 7 by 5 and vertically line up the products underneath. Remembering that that 4 is not Four, it's 40 and that 2 is 20, not 2. So 20 times 40 is 800. 20 times 5 is 100. Then we move to the 7 digit. 7 times 40 is 28 and we annex a 0. It's 280. And 7 times 5 is 35. Then we take our products and we add them together. And we get a final answer of 1,215.